Good morning traffic and good morning everybody else who doesn't have to deal with this garbage truck. Yeah, we're stuck in this two legs per second traffic right now. Uh, you know, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, yesterday, I was trying to learn something on the piano and there was this one measure which most pianists would probably laugh at me just because it's a simple you know three four measure which just means there's three quarter notes in every measure and there was probably only like five eighth notes in that for the right hand and like you know two actual chords had that had to be played by the left hand in the bass clef so in actuality it probably wasn't really that bad uh, in the real sense of pianist but for me it was a challenge and just like this traffic right here you know you sometimes think you have to get around it you have to beat it but in reality man you're just trying to get from point A to point B and that's what I'm trying to do right now yesterday when I was trying to figure that out you know I was I was trying to force myself and thinking that it was a challenge the whole time but in reality you know like I just said most pianists are probably playing, you know, 300 BPM and they're playing their Chopins, they're playing, you know, I'm not really too educated on old classical, uh, I, classical artists, but that's besides the point. Um, this is probably the worst idea I've had today to make a video in traffic, but, uh, I, I thought it was a good example, um, just because we're moving at like a terrible pace. Anyways, before I start rambling and talking about the same thing over and over again, what I'm trying to say is, it's okay to go slow. It's okay to see that a challenge is really just something that's slowing you down. But in reality, you're actually not being slowed down, you're being propelled forward. Just like right now. Even though I'm going really slow, like, what is this? I don't know. This guy's going like walking speed. I'm trying to change lanes, but you know, this is this isn't happening, but anyways, if you go slow, there's nothing wrong with it. Because if it's really something you like, it's not gonna be something that ends right after you finish the challenge. So it's really just a stepping stone in your journey, really. And if you really like it, you're gonna keep going. Well, I mean unless you're stuck on a freeway like this, let's be real here. Uh you can't leave something like this. But a challenge is really just something that we seem to create in our minds. It's a thought, right? We, we see someone else do something and then we think, man, it'd be cool if I could do that. It'd be cool if I could, you know, do like a five minute mile or something like that. It'd be cool if I could break someone else's record. It'd be cool if I could be Adam, right? If I could be myself and do something that I don't see myself doing every day. But in reality, we haven't put the time in. We haven't we haven't spent hours of training. We haven't made that our whole life story. That's not really who we are in the form of what we do. But it could be. If you started and did the exact same thing they did, and you were them, which is completely impossible, you can't shift someone's conscience like that, and you can't be someone else because you're already you. So, what you should focus on then, when you see these challenges, is to see that it's not really there. And what I mean is, you're gonna see something that's bigger than you. You're gonna see that you need to be something bigger to beat that challenge. But in reality, that's just a relational concept, right? If you want to ask someone what strong is, or if you wanted just to say, hey, I'm weak, I can't do, you know, 20, 30, 40, 50 push-ups, that's fine. No one's stopping you. But let's ask the question first. What the hell is strong? All right, we can define that as Arnold Schwarzenegger, maybe, you know, the dude who bodybuild for a living, 
the people who really put the time in to make themselves look really, really strong and compete lifting weights, yeah, that's physically strong. I'm not arguing with that. They put the time in. They put the dedication. They love doing it. That's something wrong with it. And to them, you know, they may not even think of themselves as strong. They may have someone who they think is stronger than them. So the idea of strong and the idea of weak, the idea of unskilled, the idea of skilled, it exists in a sense of relativity. And if you let that relativity stop you, you're going to be stuck on this journey just because you're got, you got your foot on the brakes the whole time. Right? If you coast on the freeway, you're still moving. If you coast in your life, you're still moving. If you make some sort of effort, it doesn't matter what you make. It's going to be helping you out in the long run. Is that a pun? Eh, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to see this as an experiment. Just to see what I sound like on camera. I haven't done this in a while. Um... So I'm sorry for the rambling if I have. Or am I sorry? Eh, whatever. Yeah, um, so what you need to see now, if you don't see it already, is that you're making up your own illusions. What you don't want to do is keep living these illusions. Alright? I don't I wanna see this world where people are constantly moving past their challenges and we're a world that's growing. I'm tired of seeing you know, people that just give up. It's cool. It's cool, I understand. You know, it's hard. Most of us may have faced different stuff. Some of us haven't even grown up in the same place. Some of us aren't even, you know, used to seeing challenges on a daily basis. And for me, I still see challenges and I still, you know, bitch out in some places. So I understand when it's super hard, you, you might want to make an excuse up. That's not really an excuse for you because you you know, you, you probably don't have those skills, but you can get those skills. All right, so why don't we all get out of our shells right now and start getting those skills? Why don't we make that dedication and let's keep moving on this road? Looks like traffic's clearing up. You guys all have a good day. Stay you.